Hello everyone, and this is Dr. Brian Capra from Genesis Chiropractic Software, and I'm here to talk to you about the newest release for the Soap Notes. They just got smarter. They actually select the diagnosis codes, or they help select the diagnosis codes and procedure codes directly from your Soap Note for you. So I want to show you the old version of the notes real quick so you understand what's different about them. Uh, right now I can go into the assessment plan uh, part and in, in previous notes we actually had this already for this part for diagnosis codes so I will go ahead and select the diagnosis code somatic dysfunction of the cervical region and let's say cervicalgia what you can see is the diagnosis codes and procedure codes I just selected just got added to the actual soap note uh, to the to the uh, actual codes that would be billed to the insurance company or just kept on the account for the for cash patient what was missing is that when you went to the actual plan section and selected let's say a procedure like an adjustment you could see the CPT codes were not added here so what does that mean what that means is that a lot of times doctors were selecting different procedures and forgetting to add them to the procedures that would get billed to the insurance company. So in some cases they were under coding. Uh, what might even be a worse situation is where you go to the actual procedures and add a procedure in your billing such as mechanical traction and if you would go back to the note the mechanical traction would not be on your note so your note was not supporting your coding. So it was a kind of double-edged sword. So it was either under coding and you weren't billing for everything you did and had documented or you were billing for things that you didn't have documented. So we got the request a whole bunch and what I'm going to do next is show you the new and improved soap note. Okay, so let's look at the new functionality. Uh, one thing you'll see is this little arrow right here. That's the new button that's been added. And just like before in the assessment section, you can go ahead and select diagnosis codes and they will be added. I'm just going to select a few at random here. And you'll see that that's actually added to your billing codes. That was there before. What's new is in the plan section when you add, let's say, an adjustment or let's say you add mechanical traction. What, it'll actually, what the system will do is give you the option to click on this button and what it does is copy the procedures that are actually in the notes. So you click on that and it says do you want to copy and you say yes and you can see the, the uh, procedures that you added to the plan section of the note were now automatically added. So that two, does two things for you. That allows you uh, to make sure that what you are billing is documented in your note and that whatever you are doing, documenting your note, is getting billed so you're not undercoding. So it's both for compliance and maximizing your revenue or your profitability. Uh, now just remember, you're still gonna have to go in here um, to your procedures, and actually if you wanna link diagnosis codes, you're still gonna have to do that. Um, and you're gonna have to add modifiers if you need to do that as well. So don't forget to do that. So that's pretty much it. I hope you enjoy that new feature. I think it should really improve your profitability and your compliance. Thank you so much.